Hello, future self. Oof. I know, looking back, back upon me, you will say, Dear God, dear God, what have I? Have, what, what am I? I? You would even give out like the three points, you know, oh, first one, one, get better lighting, second one, second one, go outside, and, and thirdly, we get some damn skincare products, you flaky, flaky individual. Well, my response to that one is, is one, I'm broke, broke, two, who, who, you know, it's Bakersfield, field, and it gets very hot here, yeah, and thirdly, the hello. Oh. Now that introduction is out of the way, I want to talk about something very, very much important, and I think you most likely know what it is. That is changing. I know changing what you might be doing or what you're going to become is scary. And I want to talk more about what you plan to become, you know, what, what your occupation is. You know, when, but of course, I have to go tell you more of the uh, life story. The most obvious one is, is how we went from wanting to become an infectious disease specialist to now becoming a molecular and medical microbiologist. I know it's very hard to even know exactly what we're going to become, even, you know, in the future. Sure, we don't know if we're going to stick to that, if we're going to stick going down that path to maybe become, I don't know, a bacteriologist, that's how it's pronounced, or a virologist, or immunologist, a pathologist, whatever it might be. I know that you're very much more interested in going into research, research and, and one day go down on to graduate school to become a microbiologist, to then become, um, I don't know, an enzymologist, you know, like a PhD in enzymology or doctorates, and whatever the case may be. I know that that most likely has changed. Because Let's be honest, we don't really know what the future is going to foretell or told what it is. I don't know if I've become a grammar Nazi, even. whatever the case may be, does not matter. What matters more is what are you planning to do with what you have gained? That's assuming, again, you stick down the path at, at UC Davis because of wanting to become a molecular and medical microbiologist. I don't know if you continue down this path all the way to becoming a researcher, then senior scientist, and then becoming, then, well, of course, taking that senior scientist position and then going further into graduate school. I don't know. But again, whatever the case may be, I just hope you're doing well. I don't know if you're also going to be looking back upon this. I mean, especially with that intro and me being a broken record. I don't know if I even gained more confidence in being able to make videos. I don't even know if you even decided to make videos. Like, let's really be honest. You know that video production takes a large amount of time. This is entirely unscripted. I'm just rambling. I'm just talking. This is just a video I'm making, just right on the spot, with nothing but a microphone, a camera, and, and well, the light that's, that could be produced in my room. And, well, because I'm unemployed, like, I don't know what else to do. Ooh. And maybe you are employed, and because you're at school... Well, you're too busy to live stream. You're too busy to make videos. You just decide, ah, who cares? And why would I even want to make this a full-time job? Uh, I mean, even, uh, like, what was it? Red Effects? I don't think that was one. Uh, the, no, that was not Red Effects. It, it was a YouTube video. You know, the, the one person that basically, like, does, does like, chemistry be like was able to turn a plastic glove into hot sauce you and i both know we'll never really be doing that you know because i don't have 
have any ideas of video editing and I have no interest to learn that. Oh, I know that. I mean, I even have interest to become an artist and a writer. They're more as hobbies, not like an actual uh, life career choice. Because even you know, oh, that's not well, financially secured in this sort of economic system. System. But what choice do we got? And I also know that at the current part, we're at the 5 minute, 36, 37, 38, 39, and 40, 41, 42, and so on, second mark. Like we still will need to make it at least to that 10 minute mark on a YouTube video to even gain any notoriety. And I also know that you have no inclinations of editing videos. I all know that because, again, I'm you. I am a past version of you. I don't know what you are in the future, but I know for a fact you have no inclinations of doing this. Why? Because you know it's tiresome. You know it's boring. And again, you also know you'll be so busy with your occupation. You'll be so focused on your career. You're so focused on that of yourself. You don't care about maybe keeping on with like other types of opportunities. Again, video production. You could become a, an educator. I know I am very much uncharismatic. Charismatic. I have about as charisma as a as like a politician or a corpo, but I just repeat myself. Oh, I lack that. You, uh, you, you again. You're my future future self. You know exactly what I'm talking about. Oh, and I bet you're even thinking, then why did you even upload this this to the internet, dingus? Guess you know damn well I'm never gonna look back upon it. Then say, you never know. Remember that? Maybe it was a maybe the second minute mark, third minute mark when it said, I don't know what you're gonna be doing. I don't even know if you're even gonna look back look sorry, not back. Uh, look back upon this. This. But I do know oh that there's always a possibility. Really, even if it's low, even if it might as well be zero, like the probability of this is like one times 10 and to the negative 20th, 25th power. But you know, it's basically almost to the point of zero. And I bet you even know about that infinite series where it's considered anything in race is to the power 10 to the negative nine. You know it well. It might as well be zero. Very well. But I'm still giving it a shot. I'm still holding out. I'm still holding out hope that you will look back upon this rambling of a Dear Diary video you know, of maybe you changed for the better. That basically, I want you to know when you're focusing on yourself, focus on your happiness. Don't just focus on the career because it's said to be the most high pain. The pay is great, yes. But what should matter is your health. You know, oh, from working at as a fast not a fast food joint, sorry, at the food service industry. You know, you we worked at a pizzeria and it was soul crushing. It was to the point that you went numb. Not once. Twice. You went numb twice. To the point that you nearly thought about jumping from the Golden Gate Bridge. I know that because again, I'm you. I'm your past. That's, that's yes. But I'm still you. And I know that life is hard. I know that. I know things are challenging. And I know that you maybe had to change things up because they didn't go according to plan. Maybe you weren't, 
and good enough for graduate school. But I would just say, don't just stop uh, because as you didn't make it. Learn from that. Learn what, from what you have gotten. You know, we, we never thought of maybe doing video production. Maybe you can still do that. Maybe you can also um, work in the lab. Maybe you can even go explain processes these to people, people that are maybe struggling with something. You, you remember that time uh, when we had to memorize and like biological processes, and one of it was you had to remember that photosystem system two comes before photosystem system one. And the way that I remember that is is two dumbasses thought that two comes before one. And you know that sort of thing. Might be incomprehensible, but it's comprehensible to us. It might even be comprehensible to other people. It's all about just, you know, find something. Find something that you are going to be the most happy with. Because the last thing that you should think about is giving up. Even though we have made it so far. Maybe a certain path is blocked. But that does not uh, mean that it blocks everything. You know, just because, rather, not a certain path block. But maybe just because we have to take a detour doesn't mean, you know, our life is over. Just because we have to go oh, somewhere else, change our ways, change our path, does not mean it's the end, is what I'm getting at. All I can hope for is that you keep on chugging. Again, even when there might be problems. I hope I made that cross to you. And if you made it this far, made it along this ramble, I hope, hope you're doing well. Oh. Now that that's out of the way, hey, I hope, hope you just made it. Yeah, I think I now understand why you maybe don't want to make these videos anymore because let's be honest, and as I said, I plan not to edit this because I, I don't know but, I mean, I guess you could say, like, well, you just need to go cut this. Well, I, I get that. I get that. But just like you, you, I'm too lazy. Again, this is not scripted. I was doing this for the sake of, it of doing it. Maybe I might make a better in a video. I don't know. But what I do hope for, and I do know, oh, at least I do know this, at least. That at least you're, you're making it. And I hope what you're making in becomes something great. That makes you happy. Because remember, happiness should be a priority. Not just the career.